Just look at what this ship is. I, I, I can't believe it. I look at what this car is. It's crazy. For me, it's a toy because it has so many interesting things, so many things different from regular cars or the cars you have. A toy, but it is an expensive toy. It's a toy for big boys. This car costs more than $300. I mean, the Lambos. Prices begin at 200 grand. Maybe a million dollars or more, depending on the model. This is the Lambo Huracan Evo. The most impressive thing is uh, the power, the speed, the engine it has. Like all Lamborghinis, the, the engine is in the rear and not at the front, as in most cars. This engine moves the car from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in just 3 seconds. It flies, buddy. It is a V10 engine with 640 horsepower. In other words, it would be about 640 horses, one in front of the other, pulling a wagon. Yeah, giving it everything, the pushing it forward. <laughs> On the front, instead of the engine, as I have just shown you. There is a trunk, well, I mean, a uh, small storage space. Possibly you can fit a backpack, but if the backpack is too big, it won't fit either because it's only 30 centimeters. Let's try to get in. <laughs> hey, anyway, I wouldn't mind riding in a Lamborghini in the front. How can the driver drive if you go there when you're going to be blocking his entire view? If you've got a Lamborghini, you drive it as you wish. Look at the color. It's like an apple green and the paint quality is very noticeable compared to the other cars. Dude, it can't be. Look at the distance the car is from the ground. How many centimeters will there be from the ground to the car? For me, as a 15 or 20 centimeters? No, for me less. There's like 12 centimeters. Look at my hand. It can fit in here. One crazy thing about this car is you see it and you can't see the handle because it's flush with the car. But when you get close to the car and hit the unlock button, Tuki, it's like... Come in, I'll invite you to my Lambo. Do it like this, and the door opens. Once inside, shut the door, and disappear again. And you can take off in your Lambo. That's awesome, man. Can I have one, please? I need this car in my life. You give it to me. <laughs> Hit the like button if you would also like to have a Lambo like this. I feel like this video has to have 7 million likes because everyone who sees it, including us, would love to own a Lamborghini. So everyone hit like right now, okay? The time has come to turn on this beast. Let's go. That's the start button. We have to lift the lid and press the button. Now let's go for a ride. Dude, it's awesome. The power this car has and the noise that makes is amazing. Taxi, taxi, taxi. Get in. Dude, this car is amazing. First of all, let's put on our seat belts. Safety first. Okay. <laughs> Did you see how fast this is? All right, but show me everything this car has first. Okay, but first... <laughs> how fun. Tell your face. <laughs> okay, I'm going to show you everything about the car here. To start the car, use this button. But the weird thing is that it has like a lock, like a lid that you have to lift it up and then press the button. This is so that when you are driving, you don't turn the car off unintentionally. Another very interesting thing is this button, which although it is very small, does something very big in the car because you can open the roof. Ah, so the roof can also be closed. Certainly this raises and... It's like a toy car. Opening the glass is very different from normal cars because there are no buttons here. Look where they are. Here, look. Down your window there and I'll down mine. How does it rise again? Wow. I love it. It is very modern. But you must press the button to lower it, unlike to the normal cars. In other words, if you press down, window goes up. Exactly. There's something unique about this car. It's the transmission. There's no gear lever here. To go forward, you have to press this shift lever. Then you throw it away and now... <laughs> to go backwards is with that button. I mean, it's in different places. Get in for a ride, but I'll drive and get in a come on. Let's see how it feels as a co-pilot. It'll be different as a co-pilot to drive the car because uh, you don't have control of the car. This car goes very fast. Are you ready? Give me a sec to buckle up. Safety first, especially with you driving. At the count of one, two, three. <laughs> it's going too fast. Fly. It's so smooth. Guys, I think this is the closest thing to Hot Wheels tracks. Like Hot Wheels when you hit them and run through the track. I just thought of something. How about we make a video that isn't 24 hours in a Lamborghini, but 24 hours in sports cars, and each one of us is 
in a different one. In a Lambo, Corvette, Ferrari, Bugatti. Hit the like button if you would like to see all of us with a different kind of car. Yeah, each one with a different one. We can race on a racetrack, but at full speed. Well, like it because we need to make that video. And subscribe because I want to make that video. Okay, we are very hungry, so let's go eat. Where could we go to eat? McDonald's. Oh, we could stop by the Automac. I mean, this will be an experience. Exactly. It's not every day you get a Lamborghini to go to McDonald's. We are here. What should we order? Maybe the same as the car in front of us. There's a car in front. We'll order the same, but we have to order it in English. Hi, could you give us the same for the, the, car, in the car in front? Well. Buenas. <laughs> They spoke to us in Spanish because they know we can't speak English. Give us the same as the car in front, please. Oh, just a coffee. No, let's change the challenge. Four Happy Meals, please. Okay, we already ordered our food. Now we have to pay. I'm afraid of crashing this. Oh no, I'm too far away. Look, the road through which one has to pass is very narrow. And this car is so wide, it's kind of scary to hit it. Besides, it's short, so if there is a sidewalk, you can kind of... But luckily, nothing has happened yet. Let's hope nothing keeps happening. Right. One Happy Meal, another one, the last one. Thank you. Okay, let's park to see what toys we got. Look at the drinks. They are one of each color. Hey, someone is hitting our car. Guys. Come in. What did you order? Wait, we're going to open this so we can eat everything? I am too hungry. What did you buy? Happy Meals, there is one of everything. There's a hamburger, cheeseburger, six nuggets, and four nuggets. So it's a surprise. Let's see what we each get. I got the hamburger, but the one with cheese or without cheese, the whole hamburger. I got the six nuggets. Wait. Oh no, you are the lucky one. I got the four nuggets. <gasps> Actually guys, I think I love these Happy Meals with fruit in them. I would trade my hamburger that I got for all of your fruit. It's true, here in America, Happy Meals are different. It comes with the food you order, I mean the hamburger or whatever. It comes with the fries, which I dropped, and it comes with fruit. In this case, it's apple. Did you get an apple? What is in the box? They are Pokemon cards. I got Pikachu. Oh no, they're all Pikachus. But it is inside. I got a Pog. Pikachu. Me too. I think it's not a Pog, but it's like part of the game. I got a Quaxley, a Sea Turtle, and a Tandemoss. What a weird name. I got Pikachu. You also got a Cyclozar. What a weird name Pokemon have nowadays. Look, Palmy and Blissey. For me, those Pokemon, they always had those names. It is not new. There are just more Pokemon now. You say that now they added more Pokemons? Yeah, because Pokemon has been around for a while. Ash is old now. I don't know if it's still Ash or there are other characters now. Guys, I got this one. I don't know who he is, but he's too cute. I also got Cyclozar, Fuecoco, and Palmy. And now let's see what I got. And you will decide in the comments who got the best card. Me, me, Valen, or Asbel. Let's see. I have all names that I can't read. I've got one called Sprigatito, which I admit is pretty good. It's like a cat, also a plat. I also have one called Curlia, one called Fiddle, and Zandaconda. I think the best one was you because you got Pikachu. Obviously, Pikachu is the main one. Like, if you are Team Pikachu. And subscribe if you are Team Zandaconda. No one will subscribe then. We said with Asbol that if everybody subscribed, we were going to make a video, each one in a different sports car, a competition, a Hello. race. What would be your favorite car? I say, uh, Ferrari. Yours? A McLaren? Bugatti. No, I want the Bugatti. Okay, two Bugattis. Ah, that is, if we drive the same car, the best driver will win. We will really be able to see if it's the car or the driver. Check out this hamburger trick, because I don't like to eat a lot of bread. So I take one bread and I put a lot of fries in it. Well. Would have been better with sauce. I'll tell you if it's good. No, you want to eat my hamburger? You didn't give me nuggets. It looks like a hot dog. Okay guys, that was the whole video. I hope you liked it. It was really an experience very good for me. To have been in this car is crazy. It's hard to believe. Was a good time? Super. Oh no, wait, we didn't show the beverages. I want to show you this drink. I've already said goodbye to the video, but this is good because this drink is red. And there aren't that many red sodas. It has a slight cherry flavor. Let's see this one. Uh, this one is orange. Uh, mm, it's good. Something is hidden among all this design. If you push this, a cup holder comes out. <clears throat> then you can be in your Lamborghini. Drinking a soda. See you in the next video. Bye.